Okay, so welcome back to Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, um yeah. I was offline for a long time and <laughs> I mean obviously the reward was just waiting there for me. I mean the login login bonus uh <laughs> so yeah. Uh anyway, hey guys, welcome back to Monster Hunter World. Today we're gonna um See if there's any new quests around here. Like, I can see this exclamation point right here. Let's see what this guy wants. A hunter from the fifth, are you? Then you must have finished your first quest. This is ecological research, headed up by yours truly. Tell me, did you find any monster data out there? Tracks, gashes, that sort of things? Data tells us a story about the monsters. Your job in the field team is to track the monsters, collect data, and adva advance the study. Our job is to take that data, analyze it, and compile our findings for the commission. What we learn helps you out in the field too. So you see, we need each other. <laughs> I'll be here. Drop by here anytime and I'll show you what we're working on. So what is it? Um, yeah, basically... Uh, the more you collect the tracks and gashes and stuff like that, the more you, you know, advance the research. So, yeah. Uh, let's see. Okay, so, so far we got only two monsters, because, um, these are the, the first two big monsters there. If you guys remember, uh, this is the monster that attacked the handler, and this is the monster that attacked the, this monster attacking the handler. <laughs> so, uh, this is the, the Great Jagras, the pack leader of the Jagras. When hungry, Great Jagras are known to attack monsters even stronger than themselves. It balloons to unbelievable proportions after swallowing prey. And this is its characteristics, and for useful information, this is... This, is, this can be really useful when battling this monster, and uh, it's... Everybody should read these information because um, it can actually help you a lot, and um, it can it can pretty much be a determining factor if you like win the battle or not. So uh, even after a great meal, a great jagras, a giant meal, a great jagras can use its expanded stomach to attack unsuspecting hunters. Aim for its belly to force it to vomit out its prey and significantly weaken it. And Anjanath, the Anjanath patrols the ancient forest looking for his favorite meal, Aptanath. This belligerent monster, I'm not sure if I pronounce that right, it's pretty much first time me seeing this word. <laughs> uh, this belligerent monster attacks, uh, will attack anything without hesitation. Anjanath, Anjanath spits, spits fiery blasts from its mouth, utilizing a unique organ in its throat. Focusing attacks on its throat will make battling it much easier. And Zora Magdaros, it's... This guy is responsible for the voyage uh, disaster. Remember when the ship uh, ran aground? Or like, a monster? <laughs> Let's see if there's any more people want like they want to talk to me. These lifts are useful. I don't think they're... Yeah, there's no one who wants to talk to me at the moment. So let's just go to the handler, see um, see what she has to say. Hey there, partner. Right, so the next thing we need to do is take care of, of those Castadon. Um, the chief said he'd, he'd be tagging along with us. How about we start our, our search in the ancient forest and go from there? Ah. Oh, and I've got some good news. We handlers post all the lead, all the leads we find up on the quest board. You can sign up for the quests there too, so you don't always have to come all the way up here. But then again, you might miss out on all, on all the eats up here. Oh yeah, because it's the canteen, right? And this girl you likes can to eat. Alright, let's eat first before... 
excuse me, going out. <clears throat> um, I guess this is this is this is the platter that I always choose. This is like the chef choice. We're on the hunt. Let's head to the ancient forest to research those casted on. Let's see if we got any optional. We do. We have actually. Oh, oh! This this is the quest for um, for the chef, right? For um, for new ingredients. But with this this will wait. Just one more quest. I think I'll do that next time. See all the different events that are available. I can only do one. But I'll do I'll do an assigned first. Just so we progress a little bit more before, uh, before we, no, nope. before we, um, before we start to basically just go on our own and uh, do our own stuff. Uh, when lucky vouchers are used when posting quests, you receive bonus rewards up upon completing the quest. Be sure to use vouchers whenever you have the chance. Random quests reward are guaranteed to drop. Reward money doubles. That's nice. And I got a lot of voucher vouchers uh, from the login bonus. So, yeah. I'll use one. I'll get uh, double the money. So, that's always good. Uh, and wait one second. I will... I want to sort my inventory a little bit. Mm. Actually, that. Uh, flash pods, yeah, I'll use those. And Nation. Oh, this, these are the things that I've got. Um, I think from my first login bonus uh, because of the. the movie collaboration monster hunter movie collaboration uh rewards which i won't use because i don't like to get boosted so um so i, I never was a fan of you know boosting myself because what's the point in you know doing that okay so the quest is ready and let's uh, go Yeah, yeah. Nope. Did not want to do that. I didn't catch it. Dang it. <laughs> These are Aptonaut, by the way. The, um, uh, Angelus spray. <laughs> Those, my friend, are Kestodon. Let's see you take him out on your own. Where? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I see them. Be careful. These guys. Cast it on like to head okay. Nope. I don't have enough uh, energy stored up in my sword yet. This guy likes to charge. Ow, no. Oh, he, he went for blight. No, oh, dodge. Ah, there we go. I guess the male is way more aggressive than female. Ah, he down. one. Okay. And one more. Or not, actually. No, never mind. A lot more. Let's loot. Alright. Let's look for another group. Be careful. The Castodon are the least of your worries. There are a lot bigger monsters lurking in this forest. 
The endemic life around here can come in handy during a hunt. Try to learn as much as you can about them. All right. Yeah, this is a healing flower. Let's see. I like the scout flies. They always um, what do you call that? They always lead you to like the right location. Over here. I. If it wasn't for scout flies and the map, I would have no idea where that guy was. Huh. Oh, there Be we careful. go. Oh, there's two males this time. I get. I'll charge my blade on the female and then release it upon the male. Ow. I still gotta learn how to use this um, weapon. Because honestly, I'm. First of all, I, was, I wasn't playing for a long time. And I kind of. Forgot how to. Ouch! I kind of forgot how to. Um. God, I can't focus. <laughs> uh, I kind of forgot how to play with this weapon. And um, come on, sharpen up fast before this guy charges me. Thank you. No. Nope. Oh. Okay. Nice. Wait. Oh man, that's weird. Oh, that guy's not dead yet? No, oh, okay. Thought it was a double kill. You're a stubble, stubborn little guy. Still alive after all this time. That just about wraps up our work here. Wait. Does it? Hey, come here! I think I found something. Well, I mean, there's still one female that I have to call. See, with the males, you can you can loot them twice because they're bigger. <laughs> I love that attention um, to detail. Look at this um, revolters. What just happened? I cannot move. Okay. Here. Hmm. Hmm. Look at those Kestodon. Something's up over there. <laughs> oh no. Now, now! Super agitated gray jaguars is bad news for us. We need to take it down. Gotcha. Nice. Okay, so all right, first partner. of all, new assignment incoming. Take down that great jaguars. If you're not ready, you can return to base and take on the great jaguars quest later. Nah, Wanna man. I'm ready for you. We need to we need to aim for the belly. They said. Uh, it your said for help. in the book. You're going to need friends when you go up against some of the tougher monsters. In order for the scout flies to better track a target monster, we need to keep finding traces of it. Like footprints, for example. I think I'm way off right now. Hmm. <laughs> I'm not sure it went in this direction. So I kind of can't find any traces. Unique mushroom colony. It's kind of so peaceful in the forest right now. 
about my first endemic life. Well, I'm not sure if it's first. I can't remember if I caught any before, but... Like, there's... There's... Something at every step and every corner of this forest. And I love this. It's, it's a lot of, um... A lot of nice things. Am I even following the right thing? Because I'm not sure. Yeah, it must be. Probably. And this, this great Jagras really hit well, huh? Oh, there it is! Likely to lose sight of a monster if you use the focus camera. Land your claw on a monster to grab it. Dodge their attacks. Don't forget you can guard too. Oh yeah, I, I totally forgot I can guard. Nope, did not want to do that. If you're clever, you can use the slinger to distract monsters. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Please go back. Ooh. This guy's a tough guy. Oh no. Please hit, please hit. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Shit. Like the best attack. Missed. Okay, let's heal up. First of all. Okay, the monster's tired. Now's your chance to deal some serious damage. Get the monster flying into the wall. That's a slinger for you. I mean, not a slinger, a clutch claw. <laughs> oh, there we go. Come on, big boy, topple. Oh my god. That hit was OP. This weapon is... I, I love it. Scout flies as a guide and will lead you right to it. Oh boy, that monster's really mad now. Be ready for some vicious attacks. <laughs> vicious attacks. You got none on me. Let's collect every track we see, because it's definitely going to be useful. More endemic life. Gotta catch them all, gotta catch them all. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I saw something here. There it is. Another track. There's a lot of tracks, and I should um really collect all of them. Why are you running up? No! Ooh! I had luck. I was, um... I was a little bit beneath that guy. I like, I like to see when he's... 
He's toppled. I mean, not toppled, um... <sighs> Sometimes it's... Sometimes it's hard to focus when you try to speak and battle a monster at the same time. It's kind of hard to focus. Oh, nice. Ouchie. <laughs> no, that was not good. Oh, really? I killed him with a. <laughs> I killed him with a slinger. <laughs> Who would have thought? Like, I actually killed this guy with a slinger. Oh my god, that was kind of funny. I didn't expect that. I, I thought this guy had a lot more in him. I wasn't expecting him to die already. But I guess I'm just like OP as hell and yeah, <laughs> he got nothing on me. Hey, he got nothing on me. I really like to loot everything that I can. Get away. Get away. Get away. Nice. Good job, Light. We got him. I guess we were more than ready for him. <laughs> Got a lead. Hmm. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Let's check it out. There's our mark. Something's got him agitated. <laughs> Look over there. What in the heck is that? I've never seen anything like it. You think it's from Zora Magdaros? I'd like to find out. But we better report back first. All right? There's all sorts of beasts in this forest. I mean, not just a forest, but... I love it. <laughs> There we go. Nice. And we got a right to take on number two us. I mean, two star assignments now. So that's, that's actually pretty good. And now we can... Oh, so I'll start. Not just following that assignment um, quest line, but I also... I'll definitely start doing optional quests and stuff like that so you know requests from from like people so you think you found some something that will lead us to Zora Magdaros 
Well, it's, I'd send some researchers out now, but I'm not, um, but not with that pissed off Puke Puke hanging around. Uh-huh. Puke Puke territory. That's pretty deep in the forest. We'll better, we'll be better equipped to take it on. Once our team from the research cent uh, center is done rebuilding the forest camp, once it's ready, we can make our move. Wanna get going? Until then, we do everything we can to help them get that camp up and running. Let's get to it. Once the camp is set up, you can go after that Puke Puke. Hmm, I wonder where the resource center is. I prefer to name him Pukey Pukey. I don't know why, just Puke Puke kind of doesn't uh, resonate with me right let's see what feeling? this guy has to say so hunter have you got uh, have you gotten used to how things work around here new world new rules it's something you have to get used to but you will have to get used to it uh you have to your life's counting on it not to mention others as well huh. look around you everyone here strange or crazy as as they may may seem they've all crossed the sea just like you and they've all carried out their duties. They looked the new world in the eye and realized the old way of doing things wouldn't cut it. Didn't stop them though, they had conviction. Do you have conviction, Hunter? <laughs> you should get to know your colleagues. Um, maybe some of that craziness will rub off on you. Ha! <laughs> yeah, you know what? Maybe, maybe it will. And, um. Hey, you. The world is moving faster and faster. The young hunters and your gadgetry, it's too much for me. Old is gold, I say. Sometimes that's also true. Uh, I want to check something first before I call it a day. I want to see the new armor available. Also, oh, the smithy wants to talk to me as well. That reminds me. You making use of the clutch claw, hunter? Yeah, uh, your slinger is a lot more than just a pea shooter these days. Perfect for taking the fight to a monster. Wrap along the beast and clobber to your heart's content. Or till your stamina around till, till your stamina runs out. Try it for yourself. Hmm. I know there was a quest for getting in some claw combat somewhere. Ah, here it is. One star optional quest, learning the clutch. Have a good Give it, give it, give it a go sometime. Alright. Now you show me the armor, please. Because I just, I want a little bit of an upgrade. I can say that, I guess. There's a, there's a casted on armor available. Oh, it's only the, it's only the, um, the arms, right? The Jagras. It doesn't look bad. It actually looks pretty good. But I can only make uh, Greaves so far. You know, is it even better than my current armor? Right. Oh, yeah, it actually is. Um, let's see the skills. Hmm. Wait. No, like that. Um, I guess... Yeah. I'll start making this armor slowly. And once I have every piece, I will actually, you know, start equipping it. Um, so, yeah. Uh, no, not yet. I can make a bone armor. It's a bit better than my current armor. And the skills are... Ooh, a tag boost. I'll actually equip that right now. Because I, um... I want a bit of an attack boost, I guess. Uh, there we go, um... And this, I'll also... Wait, let's compare, let's see, I have... A slugger, yeah. I'll also make this. So I can slugger monsters easily. 
I mean, more easily. Mm. I guess it wouldn't hurt if I make also some leggings for now. So Sandhound and Horn Maestro. Um, yeah, I'll leave that with my current skill. Let's see the weapons. Let's see, maybe I can actually make a... Um, a better charge. No, I already have it. What about upgrading? Can I upgrade? Oh, wait, I can upgrade this, but... Yeah, no, I don't have enough uh, armor spheres. You get armor spheres, like, do with doing um, side quests, I guess, and... I'll definitely do that. Uh, first, select a weapon. Yes. Uh, wait. Mm, yeah. Okay. This is basically the pure basics. Uh, let's actually upgrade this. Hmm. I can make a Jagras uh, strong arm. I need Jaguar's material for that, so uh, I don't have enough currently, but let's see, this element has no element so far, but I have this one is Thunder. Um, I guess I'll have to wait until I have a bit more materials so I can actually see what I'll be making, um, but until then I'll just... Um, until then, I just won't make anything out of it yet. Let's see that? Is this anything? This can water. Ah, oh, this can progress into poison. Nah, no, I'll, I'll I'll wait until I until I actually have um. Oh wait. That reminds me. I will actually make armor for blight if I can. Uh. Yeah, because he'll need armor. Let's just see which one doesn't look completely terrible. <laughs> this one's kind of funny, right? Hmm. I guess... I don't know. <laughs> Uh, I guess I'll make him this chest piece. Uh, no, yeah. Uh, wait. Did I equip it? I don't think I did. No, I didn't. Uh, you know, I'm trying to... I'm trying to balance everything between good looking and actually practical and useful so this is kind of a dilemma for me because with this like pal palico armors don't look that good so right now i guess what i'll do is just make him a, a better weapon because that actually helps in the battle but um i won't be making the helmet because it does in my opinion doesn't look that good uh no wait wrong wrong thing I need to be at a smithy to change to change the Pelico um, <clears throat> equipment. Uh, this one. He actually looks he actually looks uh, good with this armor. <laughs> so yeah. Hey, Blight, we're both wearing bone armor right now. <laughs> so uh, yeah. Okay. So thanks for tuning in today, guys. Uh, I'll try to upload as much as I can, um, and uh, yeah, this is a super productive day, and I hope you guys join me in the next episode, or like the next adventure, but until then, I'll, um, yeah, see you later, peace.